hello everyone welcome back to my channel today I'm going to show you how to use spray paint brush tool for very easy photo manipulation so to start off with I'm going to create a document according to my image size so I'll go to file new and then adjust the word to 1550 and the uh, height to 1000 and i'm going to click ok you can create the photoshop document to whatever size you like next i'm going to switch the foreground color and background color so the foreground color will be white and background color will be black and then i'm going to click on the adjustment layer icon and click gradient then change the gradient preset to foreground to background and click ok and then change the style to radial and for the scale i'm going to increase the level to over 200 this you can experiment with and then click ok when done adjusting the settings the next step is to open your image so go to file place and then choose your image and double click on it and then you can resize the image to fit the canvas size and then commit the changes now i am going to quickly add a new layer by clicking on the add a new layer icon which creates layer one then select the brush tool then choose the spray brush tool from the brush types as you can see the effect of the brush is way bigger than the image so to resize I'm going to press the left square bracket on my keyboard to make it smaller then to apply the brush tool I'm going to click once on top of the image I can also change the angle of the spray paint like so while I'm spray painting my image I'm going to keep resizing the brush and I'm also concentrating on the face because I want that to stand out once I am happy with how the spray painting has turned out, I am going to close the brush editing menu. For those of who you would like to add text, select the text tool and place it wherever you like and proceed to write your desired message and then commit the change. To resize your text, you can activate the free transform tool by holding down Ctrl and T on your keyboard and resize the text the next step is to merge the text layer and layer 1 to do this I'm going to hold down the control key on my keyboard and select layer 1 along with the text layer which is already selected I'm going to press control and E on my keyboard which will merge both of the layers together Moving on, I'm going to select the image layer and drag it so that it is on top of the brush effect layer. Then click on the layer menu followed by create clipping mask. Here you can again select the brush tool to make any changes to your spray painting. I'm going to leave it at this as I am happy with the way it came out. I'll now add an effect to the brush effects layer. So to do this I am going to click on the brush effect layer and then add a layer style icon then drop shadow here I am going to change the size to 7 the distance to 7 as well and you can also change the spread I am going to change it to 3 and then click ok so we are finally done with our spray painting photo manipulation edit now to save the document as always go to file save as jpeg format then choose your desired location and hit save there you have your image edited using the spray paint brush tool i hope that you have learned something new today and thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to my youtube channel and i'll see you again soon